Hey guys, and welcome back to our channel. Today's video, I'm gonna be talking about some of my favorite baby products that we've used in the past seven and a half months uh, with Bryce. So let's jump to it. First, um, we're gonna start with diapers, diaper changing, all that stuff. My favorite wipe dispenser is the Ubi wipe dispenser. It has a little weight, a little weight inside that holds the, um, the wipes down. Just comes right out, which is easy. It's a lot better than trying to fool around with one of the packs, especially for late night changes. Um, this is a real game changer. <laughs> In regards to wipes, the, t the brand of wipes that we prefer that we like most are the Pampers Pure. Um, not sponsored at all. Um, we just really like this brand. Bryce does have very sensitive skin. So this is really, really good. It's 99% water. So we either use these or water wipes. Water wipes are also another good brand. And with diaper changes, we like Pampers. Um, prefer the Pamper Swaddlers um, and Pampers Pure. We've tried the Baby Dry ones, not my favorite. Those ones are not my favorite. I prefer the Swaddlers or the Pure. I feel like they just keep Bryce dry more um, than Baby Dry. <laughs> That's just my preference. Also, for holding wipes on the go, I really prefer the Skip Hop um, wipe dispenser. They have different colors. I know they have like a pink one um, with like a pink strap and a pink top um, and clear lid, but they have different kinds, different colors. Uh, so we just got the generic one. So this is great and it fits, it fits right into our diaper bag, which is amazing. Speaking of diaper bags, the diaper bag that we have and I prefer is the Petunia Pickle Bottom. So we have the Mickey Mouse uh, from 90th uh, birthday. We have that. It's really nice because it has, um, it folds down. It folds down and there are two compartments. So we put our, our wipes in one pocket, the other pocket we have, I've got diaper rash cream, and it also comes with a change pad, which is removable. So it's removable by Velcro. There is plenty of storage inside as well. So you can either wear it as a backpack, which that's what we do, we, um, we wear it as a backpack, or Wear it as a shoulder bag, so and just adjust the strap. So yeah, it's your preference. I personally like it. Um, it really hasn't gotten any kind of wear and tear on it, so I really like it. I prefer this the Petunia Pickle Bottom. They are kind of pricey, but well worth the price. Next um, baby product that I really like and I loved for the first few months of Bryce's life were swaddle blankets. We obviously don't use them anymore. We don't swaddle him at night because ever since he started rolling over at two and a half, three months of age, um, we had to unswaddle him. These came extra handy. So these are the three different brands that I like. Um, this one, it's a little, little taco. <laughs> um, it's Lulu Lollipop. So soft. This brand of swaddle blankets are super, super soft. This one is a muslin swaddle from uh, Swaddle Me. It came in a pack of three. And then this one is Lulu Joe. This one is huge, but it worked really well. 
So these three brands I prefer because they also stretch. Speaking of lounging around, there's a lot of mixed reviews about this product and some people will say don't get it, it's way too expensive and you're never going to use it. Some people will say it's great, get it, like there's a lot of mixed reviews. We got it. It is the Docatot and this came in handy the first, like, we've used this every day. <laughs> I can't hear Bryce. <laughs> He's playing with daddy downstairs. Um, <laughs> so we've used this every day for, I would say, like three and a half, four months almost. We got good, really good use out of this. And basically, like Andrew and I would, we would sit on the couch. This Dr. Tot would go right in between us. Bryce would just lay right in it. Sometimes he'd fall asleep, but we're there. Like we were there watching him um, and making sure he was safe. But this was really good and he loved this thing. It's totally up to you if you want to get this or not. Um, you know, it is, it is uh, pricey, but it really worked well for us. Now, another product that it took a lot of trial and error with Bryce is baby bottles. Bryce did not like certain baby bottles. He, he did take two brands his first month of life. And that was the Dr. Brown's and the Avent or Avent uh, brand. He was fine. But after that, he really did not like them. He kind of just would not take a bottle at all. So we had to find a different bottle. So I did my research and I found the Nano BB or Nano Baby. This is just the cover, like this is just the cap. Um, we have the actual nipple here. It is a breast-like bottle. And this worked wonders. Like, Bryce still takes this bottle, which is great. Um, I do have to try to get him onto other bottles to see if he'll take those, but this, this worked wonders. And it's also, it's also how like it dips in on the inside. So like the easiest way to pull it apart, like this is how you take it apart to clean it. Super easy to clean too. You don't need a bottle brush. You do need a nipple brush um, to clean the inside of the nipples, but that's it. Super, super easy to clean. That's also why I prefer these two. They're not as expensive as Comatomos. Um, I did look into those because those are also another breast-like bottle. Um, those are very expensive. <laughs> Up here in Canada, it is. Um, these Canadian price, maybe about like 12 bucks. That's what I paid. I think it was like 12 bucks that I paid per bottle. Now the next product that I really like is from Frida Baby. This is a little carrying case that came with the kits um, that we got for our baby shower. This is one product that some of you guys might find disgusting. I found it disgusting at first too, but it works. It is the Nose Frida. So basically, you put this part in the baby's nose, this part in your mouth, and you suck. Just to get all the, the bookers out, the mucus out of their nose, and it, it works. Some babies don't like it, some babies are like, what's going on? But it works. It gets a lot of the boogers out of his nose when he's sick and congested. It clears his nose and helps him to breathe better. Um, I've tried the ball, the bulb suction. 
hated it. I hated it because it didn't work properly. Bryce hated it. So I tried this and he's fine. Now for the last products that I like um, are a infant training cup. Bryce loves this. So we use this for water every morning. Um, and he loves it. And it's also good for him to chew because it is silicone. He, he chews on it. It helps with his gums and his teeth. Um, we use this for breakfast every morning with water. And it's a good training cup to for him to practice to put, like to grab the cup and put it in his mouth and drink and all of that. Also another, uh, it's a sippy cup, but I don't know what brand, this is Munchkin. Munchkin brand. And it's good because it has, it's a straw, but it also has a straw that goes all the way down with a weight at the end that has a hole at the bottom of it. If your child like tips the cup, the weight in the straw follows wherever the water's gonna go. So that way they're still drinking their liquid, their water, juice, milk, whatever. Um, and that way they're not sucking in air too. So that is it for some, some of my favorite baby products. There are a ton more that I like, um, which I might do in a separate video. I might do favorite baby gear, video about nursing gear, what I think are the must-haves for a new baby. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and we will see you guys in the next one.